Hello sim racers and welcome to another Pit Lanes lap with video. Today we're in Project Cars 2 and we're checking out one of the cars from the recently released Spirit of Le Mans DLC pack. We are in the 2016 spec Audi LMP1 and we're at, uh, well where else would we be? But at the classic Le Mans track and uh, just to see what it's like in VR at night we're here at one o'clock in the morning just to start with before we uh, commence the lap just look at the level of detail inside it, everything if I turn the lights on and off look at it, everything all just illuminates up got your rear view camera but in VR you just want to reach up just to two of those knobs turn the dials push the button it just feels right you know you've even got little sc information screen up there look with wee different tires and brake temp it's just <laughs> oh, just I love it when developers pay attention to detail in VR it, it, it makes such a difference. So that's the uh, interior of the car. What we will do now is settle in and go for a lap and see what it's like. And one of the first things you notice is the uh, how well the lights reflect inside the cockpit you get beautiful shadow cast in across the cockpit when it goes light and dark as it passes underneath the lights <laughs> it just works really well adds to the immersion in VR especially But it's such a different sounding vehicle. You know, it's not a hybrid, it's a a diesel engine. So you've got that unusual engine and exhaust note. It doesn't rev particularly high. And even though it doesn't sound like we're going, you know, we're going fast or we're going anywhere. If you look at the speed, look, we're coming up to 320 kilometers before we got a break for this first chicane and then you quickly up the box as the low revving well the narrow rev band of a diesel becomes apparent but these cars are just so amazingly stable you got no sense of the true speed you're doing. <laughs> Oi. A little bit too much power there on the corner exit. But I'll tell you what you really do get a good sense of is just how s compact this uh, cockpit area is. You know, these are these are big cars. They have a lot of presence out on the track. But you're just stuffed into this tiny little cockpit. You know, you almost feel like your head's rubbing on the roof. It just sort of, you know, you're in this confined little cabin in the dark. Everything just really focuses you on the oh, a little bit of a lock up there makes you focus on the track really draws you in Ooh. can you imagine what it must be like in real life to spend hours upon hours cooped up in this little car in the darkness you know, 
you start to get a little bit more of an appreciation for what these endurance drivers must go through. Oh, a little bit too hot there. But these things are just very, very direct. They're very point and squirt. You know, I'm used to some of the old tin top cars where they wallow about and they sway about, but this is very pointy, very directional. Every little steering input matters. Whew. I tell you what, it's all you need. It's just a lap. You can really start to get a, a real feel for what it must be like, you know, to endurance racing. Oh, oh. well, that was. A lap with Project Cars 2 in the Audi 2016 Le Mans Spec LMP1. Around where else but Le Mans? And, uh, well, you need to check out the description, pop along, use the links, get hold of this DLC because they've got these hybrids, uh, the real, well, the last generation LMP ones, and they've got some real classic. Le Mans cars well worth checking out as we wait to see what this uh, recently leaked Ferrari DLC is going to be about but as always as all sim racing developers at the moment each new bit of content they release each new update they bring to us they're just raising the bar each and every time and it's just 2018 is just turning out to be a fantastic uh, year for sim racing. Yep. Whichever sim, whichever developer you prefer. Right, just before I go, it'd be brilliant if you could uh, like, share, subscribe, hit the bell notification. We release videos all the time. Also, it'd be great if you could check out our social media pages. We've got all kinds of sim clips, pictures. We've got a really active Discord group where we discuss anything and everything sim racing related all the titles all the different developers you know come and tell us what you like what you don't like what you're currently into what you're currently looking forward to set a course of competition early access it's only just around the corner now as well so I'm sure that's going to be a topic of conversation coming up but that was a pit lanes lap with video I'll see you in the next one. Happy sim racing.